friends, how are you doing today? We are here, I'm here with my helper Spencer and Reese, and we are here to have some fun doing some music and movement today. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna sing a little hello song. We're gonna sing it two times. So if you don't know it the first time through, that's okay, just do your best to follow along, and then maybe you'll have it just right on the second time. Are you ready? Here we go. Hello all my friends, how are you? Hello all my friends, how are you? It's time to start our day. We are here to sing and play. Hello all my friends, how are you? Pretty easy, right? Mm -hmm. We're gonna do it one more time, are you ready? Here we go. Hello all my friends, how are you? Hello all my friends, how are you? It's time to start our day. We are here to sing and play. Hello all my friends, how are you? Awesome work. All right, let's sit down crisscross applesauce, hands in our lap, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about what we're gonna to do today. Today, we are gonna be playing with some teddy bears. Why do you think I picked b -b bears to play with today? B. That's right, because we are talking about letter B, 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 B. So we're, all of our activities and our songs today are going to be with B, B, bears. So if you have a teddy bear, you can pause the video and go get one, because we are going to start out with our fun activities singing a song about teddy bears. So go ahead and get your teddy bear. Everybody get a teddy bear. Here we go. We're gonna sing a teddy bear song. We're gonna start out really slow. We're gonna sing it a few times. We're gonna start slow, and then we're gonna get faster and faster and faster. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. We're gonna do nice and slow. Get your teddy bear, or you can use any stuffy that you like. It doesn't have to be a teddy bear, but I like teddy bears because it starts with B, B, B. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Teddy bear, teddy bear, turn around. Teddy bear, teddy bear, touch the ground. Teddy bear, teddy bear, jump up high. Teddy bear, teddy bear, touch the sky. Teddy bear, teddy bear, bend down low. Teddy bear, teddy bear, touch your toes. Teddy bear, teddy bear, turn out the lights. Teddy bear, teddy bear, say good night. Nice job. We're gonna sing it just a little faster. Do you think you can sing it a little faster? Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Teddy bear, teddy bear, turn around. Teddy bear, teddy bear, touch the ground. Teddy bear, teddy bear, jump up high. Teddy bear, teddy bear, touch the sky. Teddy bear, teddy bear, bend down low. Teddy bear, teddy bear, touch your toes. Teddy bear, teddy bear, turn out the lights. Teddy bear, teddy bear, say good night. Good job, okay. Now it's gonna get really silly. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. We're gonna see if we can sing it super fast. Oh no. Oh no. Do you think we can sing it super fast? Yes. No. Okay, I can't. we're I gonna can't try. Do it. I can't do it. Are you ready? Here we go. Teddy bear, teddy, teddy bear, bear, turn around. Teddy, teddy bear, teddy bear, touch the ground. Teddy bear, teddy bear, teddy bear, jump up high. Teddy bear, teddy bear, teddy bear, touch the sky. Teddy bear, teddy bear, bend down low. Teddy bear, teddy bear. <laughs> Touch your toes, teddy bear, teddy bear, turn out the light, teddy bear, teddy bear, say good night. <laughs> good job, kiddos. And everybody sit back down, crisscross applesauce. Nice job. I'm going to put my teddy bear right here with Spencer and Reese, and I'm going to move on to the next thing. I have some shapes to share with you all. We have just a little bit of review. I think you all know these shapes. What is this shape? Circle. A circle. A circle. Very good. This is a circle. What is this shape? A triangle. 
A triangle. Mm. A triangle. How do you know it's a triangle? Because it's three sides. It has three sides. Let's count the sides together. Ready? One, One two, two, three. Three. Very nice. What's this shape? A square. A square. This is a square. You're right. And how many sides does a shape have? Or does this shape have? Four. 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 A square has four sides. Let's count them. One. One. Two, three, four. four sides in a square. Now this one is a little trickier. Hmm. Rectangle. Rectangle. A rectangle. Well, how many sides does a rectangle have? Four. It has four sides. So, how come it's not a square? Because it's longer. That's right. A rectangle is just like a square, except for it's been squished or stretched up. One side is longer than the other side. Let's count the sides just to be sure. Ready? One, two, three, four. And I have one more special shape. What shape is this? A heart. A heart. A heart. This teddy bear is in the shape of a heart. His face is an upside down heart and his nose is right side up, but they're both hearts. It doesn't matter if it's facing down or up. It's still a heart. Very good. We are going to do something fun with these shapes. We are going to see if we can make the shapes with our bodies. Are you ready to try? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's start out with our circle. Oh, this is going to be hard. stand up. We're going to make uh, a circle. This is too hard. First, let's see if we can write it in the sky with our magic pencils. Everybody get a magic pencil out. It can be any color you want. And we're gonna make a big circle. Are you ready? Let's start at the top. Mm -hmm. A circle goes around and around. Very good, let's try one more time, ready? Around and around. Very good. Your pencil is rainbow. Mine is what red. What color is yours, Spencer? Red. Red. Mine is turquoise. Sparkly turquoise. Okay, uh -oh. so we drew our big circles. Next, let's see if we can make a circle with our bodies. Uh, How this do you think we can do that? Wait. We know it goes around and around. But so what could we do? do? Did I make a circle with my arms? Yes! Yes, I did! Could you also make it go like this? Yeah! What shape does that look like? A circle! A circle! Very good! We made circles but with our bodies. Wait, we can do can this you think of too. any other way to make a circle? Wait, yeah. What's up? What's up? What's up? Ooh, Reese said like this. Can you make a circle with your hands? Wait, wait, how about like, wait, 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 I'm going to end up, but you, wait, if, if you can do this, then you can go like this, and then, a sideways circle? Mm-hmm. Oh, this is too hard. Let's try the side. Oh, that feels good. You feel a stretch? Yes. Oh, I like that. Very good. Let's move on to the next shape. What's this one? Do you remember? Triangle. A triangle, and a triangle has three sides. Let's so, get out our magic pencils, and we're gonna make wait, a wait, big wait, 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 triangle. Are you ready? Let's start at the top. Here we go. Down to the ground, across, and back up to the middle. Very good, we're gonna try one more time. We're gonna start at the top in the middle, and we're gonna go down to the side in the bottom, across the bottom, and back up to the middle. Good job. How can we make a triangle oh. with our bodies? Okay, good. We made one with our fingers. Can you make a triangle with your fingers? It's kind of tricky to get that bottom line very straight because a triangle is very straight on the bottom, right? Oh, look. And on the sides. How about with our arms? Can we make a big triangle? Oh, yeah. I was, I, was, I was doing that. I was doing that. Look, we made triangles with our arms. How about with our whole body? No, no. Oh, no. I bet we can imagine. Let's use our imagination. And we're going to fill up a triangle with our entire body. So let's use our feet because a triangle has not only three sides, it has three 
points or three corners or this fancy word three vertices those are the points so let's see if we can fill a whole triangle with our bodies let's use our legs those are the two points on the bottom and let's make a big tall point all the way to the top can you imagine the triangle going all the way from your fingertips down to your toes and across the floor and back up to your fingertips? Mm -hmm. I think that looks like a triangle. What do you think? Yeah, kind yeah. of, but I'm slipping. Nice job. Okay, everybody stand up straight and we're gonna go to our next shape, which is a square. square. Remember a square has four sides and they're all the same size. Let's see, can we make a square with our bodies? Yes! No! Let's try to draw it first. Get out your magic pencil. We're gonna start at the top. We're gonna go across the sky, down, across the ground, and back up to the sky. Pretty good, right? Let's try it one more time. Are you ready? Across the sky, down, and across the bottom, and back up. To the sky. And look, Very a nice. Square right there. How about we make a square with our bodies? <laughs> now remember we imagined we filled up a whole triangle. Can we fill up a whole square? No. How many corners are there on a square? Oh. Four. Four. So let's use our feet. Ready? Mm -hmm. One foot, two, two feet, feet, and how do we do two corners up in the sky? Mm -hmm. <gasps> One hand. What can we do with our other hand? You're right, we can make all four corners. Can you imagine a line going across from your fingers mm -hmm. to your fingers mm -hmm. and down to your feet and across the floor to make a big square stretch. Oh, make your square as big as you can make it. Ah! Oh, those are some big squares. Very good. Okay, everybody bring your arms and legs <laughs> back and, and stand <gasps> nice and tall. Good square making. Now, Hmm. We have our rectangle. Oh no. Oh my goodness. How can we make a rectangle? Hmm. Let's see. Let's draw it first. Okay? okay. Now remember our tri or our rectangle is just a square that's been stretched out or squished, right? Mm -hmm. So we are going to try. Get down onto the floor, please, Reese. Thank you. We are going to draw a rectangle that's been stretched up from the to the ceiling and all the way down to the ground. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Get out your magic pencils. We're going to start at the top, all the way as high as you can reach, across and down all the way to the floor to stretch it out long, across the bottom and back up to the top. Very good. Let's do it one more time. Are you ready? Here we go. Across the sky. All the way, stretch it down to the floor, across the floor, and back up to the sky. Excellent job. All right, let's get back into that square okay. and see if we can make our square into a rectangle. Let's stretch our legs out. Let's stretch our arms out. We've got our big square, all four corners. Oh, I'm and doing a rectangle can, right now. How can you make it a rectangle? Squish it out more. Oh, squish down low. Oh, now look, we're shorter than we are wide. We squished down into a rectangle. How else could we make a rectangle? Mm -hmm. Instead oh. of squishing, what could we do? We can stretch it out tall, so stretch your rectangle. Wait, you Bring can Bring your this. legs a little closer and make a big rectangle all the way up to the sky. You can do Here's this one too. corner, two corners, three corners and four corners Look, can do for this our too. rectangle. You're right, but you've got elbows. Oh. You've got to go tall like this. Oh. 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 There you go. Good oh. rectangle. That's a good rectangle. Excellent job. And I've got one more fun shape for you. Heart. What's this one? A heart. A heart. Let's get out our magic pencils. Let's draw our hearts. Hearts are kind of tricky. Yeah, I can do it. We're gonna start at the top. We're right in the middle of the heart and we're gonna go up around like a rainbow, down to the middle, back up and make another rainbow. Are you ready? Let's do it one more time. Ready? A rainbow, 
down to the bottom and up and another rainbow. This is how I nice do. job. Like this how I do. Good hearts, friends. Excellent. Let's make a tiny one with our hands. Can you make a tiny heart with your hands? Yes. Make two make... curves. That's good. Music. Put them together and put your thumbs down. And that makes a heart. What? Nice oh, job, kiddos. Oh, what? All right, everybody stretch up, reach for the sky, and back down, crisscross applesauce, hands in our lap. Excellent job. We're going to move on. We have another fun song to sing. So if you have your teddy bears, make sure you get your teddy bears, and we are going to go over the mountain with our teddy bear. Have you ever heard of the song, The Bear Went Over the Mountain? Mm -hmm. You have? If you haven't, that's okay. You're gonna sing it right now. We're gonna sing it all together. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Here we go. We're gonna march over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain. To see what he could see. To see what he could see. To see what he could see. The other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain was all that he could see. Next, we're gonna go across the river. So we're gonna swim. Are you ready to swim? Uh -huh. Here we go. Swim with your bears. The bear went across the river, the bear went across the river, the bear went across the river to see what he could see, to see what he could see, to see what he could see. The other side of the river, the other side of the river, the other side of the river was all that he could see. Excellent. Next, we're gonna go tiptoeing through the meadow. The meadow is a big grassy area in the middle of a forest. We're gonna go across the meadow tiptoeing. Are you ready? Here we go. We're going to tiptoe through the meadow. The bear went through the meadow. The bear went through the meadow. The bear went through the meadow to see what he could see. To see what he could see. To see what he could see. The other side of the meadow. The other side of the meadow. The other side of the meadow was all that he could see. Now the bear found a big, tall tree. Do you think he could see more things or less things if he climbed up the big, tall tree? More, more. Do you think he could see more? Uh -huh. Okay, let's go up the big, tall tree. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. The bear climbed up the big tree. The bear climbed up the big tree. The bear climbed up the big tree to see what he could see. To see what he could see. To see what he could see. He was so high. He could see everything he could see. The other side of the meadow. The other side of the river. The other side of the mountain was all that he could see. <laughs> Excellent job, friends. That's such a fun song to sing. I have one more thing to show you before we sing our goodbye song. I have an activity that you can do at home. Excuse me, Reese. Thank you, friend. Now, we have all of our shape cards here. I'm gonna bring you down low so you can see what I'm doing. Spencer and Reese, can you sit on the other side here? Okay, there we go. I'm gonna move you down here and we're gonna see what Mrs. Gomber is up to. Now I up have, to. up to, I have my shape cards. I'm going to attach these um, or send them to your parents so they can print these out at home. But if you don't have access to them or you don't want to print them out, you can draw circles and hearts and rectangles mm -hmm. all on 
a piece of paper. Sorry, let me get this do, set up. Or you can do it okay, with the Play-Doh. Back, sit back, please, so we don't push this. Or you can do it okay? with some so this is, shh, this is what we're going to do. Once you get your shape cards, you can put them inside one of these sheet protectors. Or if you have one of these at home, they're like the dry erase pockets that we use at school. You can put it inside there. If you don't have that, that's fine. You can do it right on the paper, or you can even put on um, a piece of plastic wrap over the top and tape it down. What we're going to do is we're going to see if we can make these shapes with some Play-Doh. So I have Play-Doh here. I'm going to show you with my circle. I have my circle and I have my Play-Doh. What you're going to do is you're going to see if you can build the shapes out of Play-Doh. So the first thing, before you build any shapes, I want to see, can you roll the Play-Doh into a ball? See if you can do that. It's tricky. It really works these muscles that you use when you write or you cut scissors. This is a very good way to work those muscles. Plus, it's really fun too, right? So we're going to make a ball. Can you do that? How about, can you smash it flat and make a pancake? Do you think you can do that? Mm -hmm. And the thing that we're gonna use is we're gonna make snakes. And we're gonna use those snakes to build our shapes. So do you think you can rub your hand side to side like this mm -hmm. to make a snake? Okay, we're gonna make a snake and then see our, our bear. We're gonna outline the circle like that. Do you see how Mrs. Gomber's putting it all around, oops, all around the outside of the shape? Okay, so you're gonna keep doing that. You're gonna make shapes, I mean, you're gonna make snakes until the entire shape is outlined, until you build the whole thing, the whole shape. I'm gonna make one more snake and push it down. And look, I've made a circle. You'll have yours nice and flat so it won't fall down like mine is, but I wanna hold it up so you can see. You see my circle? Uh-huh, I wanna see it down. How many shapes do you think you can build? Uh, do you think you can build a triangle? Uh-huh. Do you think you can build Oops, do you think you can build a square? Uh -huh. I think you can. Heart. I know you all can. I want you to try it home, okay? Mm -hmm. And before we go, we're gonna sing our goodbye song. Are you ready? But I want a surprise. You wanna sing a surprise? No, I'm gonna get a surprise. Oh, you wanna get a surprise? <laughs> well, we are going to play with Play-Doh later. I think that's a pretty good surprise, don't you? Let's sing our goodbye song. Are you all ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. This is the way we say goodbye, say goodbye, say goodbye. This is the way we say goodbye in class every day. We give our friends a big high five, big high five, big high five. We give our friends a big high five. When we say goodbye, bye, bye, bye. Bye, bye. goodbye friends, bye, bye. I hope you had fun and I will see you soon.